Okay, so the next exercise we're going to talk about is, is you know, just based off of the ones that we just performed. Uh, the difference in this one is it's a little more explosive. Uh, you know, as coaches, I know we always want to, number one, make sure athletes are conditioned well, uh, make sure they're safe, obviously, but make sure that what we're doing in the weight room is going to translate to the court, okay? So on this one, we're taking kind of the same movement that we had on the lunge. Um, I'm going to add a weight uh, starting off, uh, especially with female athletes. I wouldn't be concerned with adding weight just yet uh, because of a lot of instability in the hips and the knees um, and also in younger athletes. So, but I'm going to have a weight, nothing, nothing heavy, just a five uh, kilogram ball here. And I'm going to start in my lunge position, okay? And I call these it's just a split lunge. So on every one, I'm going to elevate. I'm jumping out of my hips, driving up off the ground, and I'm going to get as high as I can. I switch legs, and I'm right back down. So I switch, and I'm up. Switch, and I'm up. Again, every time I'm landing, if you know, it's back, flat, course tight, and I'm getting that load in the hip, Driving straight back down. Biggest thing to watch for is just like the lunges. Make sure when they're coming down, you're not seeing that lead heel pop up and shifting all the weight into the toe box, which generally means that they're going to be putting a lot of stress on the knee.